He was sleeping. And I was just laying my head on him and it was the cutest thing ever. Anyway, happy Monday. We just got back from Fort Wilderness. The vlog will be up probably before this vlog is up. So I'll link it, but it was really fun. We um, didn't really get to do much. We didn't get to go to Disney or anything because um, I mean, it's open, but I don't know. Florida is literally the center of COVID in the whole world right now. So and we're like, oh, it's not. Plus it's it was disgustingly hot, like unbearably hot and just humid. Um, it was like felt like 105 like all the days we were there you have to use a mask obviously thank god i'm glad that they're making people use masks but we were like yeah it sounds pretty miserable to already be like sweating like crazy and then put a mask over your face so we're just gonna wait a little longer for safety and for weather reasons i guess so i just got my nails done i'm so happy with how they turned out they're so freaking pretty i'll show you like I guess in like normal light in a second but it's just like the French fade with glitter and little butterfly stickers they're so cute oh my gosh there's nothing like having fresh nails like that is just the best feeling and now I'm gonna get the mail and I think that's something I ordered a little while ago is here I'm so excited to show you it I'm so excited oh and obviously I was very safe when I went my the nail studio I go to um is super small it's just two nail techs and then some hairdressers but they're like it's a very small studio and there's barely anyone in there when i'm in there and um my nail tech was wearing a mask and i sanitized i wore a mask I was doing it as safely as possible so yeah and i recommend that you do the same thing if you're getting your hair done or getting your nails done or anything like that um also i missed my car like i just i miss my time in my car like am i the only one that just that just loves being in your car like driving alone in the car is like with like worship music playing or just having a tv show on netflix like listening to it i don't watch it don't i don't advise you watch a show while you're driving either but it's just so peaceful it's just like you time there's literally no one in the car with you it's the best my car's name is ross if anyone wants to know yes from friends holy what is that Oh, hey, what are you? It has horns. <gasps> oh my God, what is that thing? Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I'm just moving the gate. I'm not gonna kill you. Please don't attack me. I very much appreciate that. <gasps> Goodness gracious. I cannot with that crap. <gasps> it's here and it's in a cute package. It's in a rose gold package. How freaking cute. outside because the dogs were freaking out when I got home as you saw <laughs> um, and they weren't giving me like two seconds to open this which I'm so excited about. so this is from a company called make it mini like I'll, I'll put it right here make it mini so cute they have like jewelry and clothes and stuff that is Disney inspired which of course I love it and they have everything in a rose gold option which because I only buy rose gold jewelry, so with the exception of this silver ring that my sister got me that I'll probably never take off because it's just sentimental, you know? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited right now. It's ironic because we just got back from Disney though, so I could have been wearing it there. It came literally the day after we got home, but that's my fault, not their fault. So it comes in this cute little package. Oh, it's upside down. Oh, look, it has it right there in rose gold oh my god i love the like aesthetic of this company so much <laughs> i'm just so excited look how oh well it's a rose gold castle necklace it's called the dream suite necklace imagination and dreams can lead you to do the impossible don't lose sight of your goals along the way and let the excitement of achievement keep you moving forward what sold me on this company was not only the aesthetic but the girl who runs the company has such a beautiful, like, 
spirit to her. She seems just so cool. She layers a bunch of Disney necklaces and it looks so cool. So I'm so excited to layer this with my um, heart rose gold necklace that I wear every single day of my life. So these were made for layering. So you can, there's a lot of, there's like a lot of room for you to change the length of it, which I really love because most of them usually like stop right there. My necklace I have on right now literally has one of these. Like it's just made to be like a shorter necklace. And this you can layer it however you want to. Oh my gosh, look how pretty. I cannot right now, I'm so excited. Ugh, look at it. Oh my gosh, it's so dainty and it like fits perfectly with the necklace that I wear every day. So I'm not gonna have to take this one off to wear this one. Like they layer so pretty. <laughs> I don't buy jewelry very often, so when I buy it, I really love it. All right, so this is um, never coming off my body. <laughs> I highly recommend following her on Instagram because her posts are super cute, and it, she just keeps you updated on all the new stuff. She's coming out with Princess of the Month rings, where every month she comes out with a ring she designs for each princess, and the ones that she's shown so far have been so beautiful. She hasn't released them yet. Like, this company is like my new favorite thing ever. Like, every time, I get on Instagram, I want to go look at their stuff. It's so cute. I'm gonna show you in the sun what it looks like. In the sun, this is what they look like. So freaking pretty. <gasps> Are you just my tired boy? Oh yes. He's just a tired little guy. Cause you were running around and playing outside. Cause you're just, you're just so happy all the time. I just don't understand how you could be so sweet. <laughs> Your face is, I, oh my God, I love you so much. I can't take it. Casito. Thank you. <laughs> oh my God, I love you. What he oh, found? Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Mappy looked at me so I could see you brushing your teeth. What's up in your mouth? That's a toothbrush. <laughs> okay. Mappy, drop it. Hold on one back. Drop it. He can use the one from the we washer. I did ready. Is there anything you want to say? Can you drop it? No. Good boy. Um, okay, so if you're wondering why my hair looks like this, I'm doing curl training. Curl training is basically where you just twist your hair around itself, tie it together. It's like helping the muscle memory of your hair curl again. So I slept with my hair like this. I actually did this in the shower and it like stayed, which is crazy. But um, if you saw my heatless curls video, I don't know why I'm trying something like this again. I mean, okay, at least this isn't supposed to look good when you take it out. You're just supposed to do it to help your hair remember, like, the pattern of a curl. Because um, I just, I used heat on it way too much for a long time because I was just so frustrated with my curls. So now it just doesn't want to, like, it doesn't want to curl the way it used to. So I'm helping my hair remember. <laughs> All right, let's do this. It actually lasted really well. I'm really proud of my hair. Wait. Is this going to look decent? It might look like when you sleep with braids in, you know? Oh, I forgot I pinned the front pieces back. You know what? That looks much better than what the Heatless Curls video did, so...
All right, well, this side looks kind of pretty, but this side, <laughs> this side was just like twists wrapped around itself. This side was actually the hair wrapped around itself. So it curled nicely. This side got twisted up somehow. This side actually looks really pretty. I mean, I wouldn't trust to wear it like this because there's no product in it at all, but. Definitely an iced coffee day. I usually don't really make iced coffee at home, but, oh, that is way too much. That is much better. <sighs> Have you ever just smelled this creamer? The Coffee Mate Hazelnut? Oh my God. It just smells, oh God, it just smells so good. You know what, you wanna know what creamer smells really good? Funfetti creamer smells exactly like Funfetti. I love that creamer, but hazelnut's probably always my favorite. We also have Cinnamon Toast Crunch back there. I never know if I should put the ice in before or after, but when I put it in before, it melts it. So, it's a little weird. All right, y'all. I just, oh, that's my bra. That did not happen. We'll just pretend like it didn't. And so I just filmed a video. I just did my everyday quarantine makeup look. Um, I just felt like filming. I didn't know what to do. So I decided to be really unoriginal and show you how to do this makeup look that literally everybody on planet Earth knows how to do. So, but you know what? I don't care. I had fun. That's all that matters. So, yeah, I'm going to, now I'm going to edit that video and hopefully get it up today. I should be able to. It's really not long. Well, I took forever to film it because I always do. I could literally make anything an hour long because I talk way too much. Um... But yeah, I'm gonna edit it down a lot. So I'll put the link in the bio because it'll probably be up before this vlog is up. Oh, I painted my toenails, a really pretty color. I'm not gonna show you my toes though. First of all, I don't really wanna show my feet on the internet for several reasons. I'm sure you can think of a couple as well. <laughs> but um, I freaking love the color I painted them. It's the OPI, do you have lay away? I think it's the name of the shade, but lay as in like, a lay like a flower necklace. See, um, I probably put the clip of me sitting in the barn. I don't know why I didn't explain my situation while I was sitting in there, but I was in the barn and then it started raining like crazy. So I was stuck in the barn with Ween and it was so cute. I just sat on the floor. I was like, I guess I gotta wait this out. And um, Ween was just laid next to me and put his head on my shoulder, my, on my shoulder. <laughs> wow, he's a really tall dog. He put his head on my knee and it was like the cutest thing ever, but I think the video I got was after the rain was over and I just was so relaxed. I didn't want to move. I was just like praying in the barn while it was raining and it was just so relaxing. The dog was just being calm laying on me. It was great. But yeah, so that's all the updates I have for now. See you in the next clip. <laughs> yeah, so excited when my dad and my brother come home. They run out to see them. It's the cutest thing ever. <laughs> Weenie, go get him! Come on! Go get him! <laughs> so my sister just called and she found two dogs laying in the middle of our road, like the middle of the road, so she had to stop so she didn't run them over. And now we're trying to get them to come into our yard so we can keep them away from the road while we go to our neighbor's houses. <laughs> and try to figure out whose dogs these are. So, literally walking down the road right now, trying to go meet her to help her get the dogs to our house. Oh my God, is that another dog? Or is that a raccoon? There's too many, this is too much. <laughs> We're good. Oh, I don't know if you can see them. They're up there. I see the dogs. This guy looks so freaking pretty right now. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but it's like pink and light blue. Looks kind of orange on camera, that's sad. She's gonna hit me! <laughs> I think they're in the car. They're in your car? They're in my car. Oh, they're licking all over me. 
They're so sweet. Honeys, I'm so sorry you're lost. Gosh, you guys are so sweet. Hi. Oh my gosh. Hi, sweet boys. Hi, sweet boys. We'll find your home. I know, we're strangers. I got you some water. I got you some water. Oh, dude. Come on, babies. Let's go. What? <laughs> Come on. Are you tired? Like, I'm laying down. What are you talking about? I think I'm going to have to pick them up. Come on. Come on. Let's get out of the car. Come on. Let's, Let's go. go. Let's go. Let's go. They're so tired. Hey, should I bring their water here? Yeah. Bring it over here. Oh, she's so scared. Look at them, like, bowing down to us right now. I know. Right? Oh. Hi. Hi. Oh. Oh. It's just puppy love. Just so much puppy love. Oh, thank you. Hi. You don't want water? Oh. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. You don't want the water? Puppy's gonna be jealous of me. He's gonna smell these other dogs. Honeys, come here. Get some water. Hi, baby. Good boy. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hi, sweet boys. Hi. <laughs> Where if someone dumped you, I'm gonna find them and hurt them. Come on. Let's go, sweet boys. Come on, baby. Come on, honey. Oh, you're peeing like a good freaking boy. Come on. Oh my gosh. Time. They don't like the water. <laughs> they don't like the water. Hi, honey. <laughs> Here's Wayne. Still wanting to hunt them. Hasn't given up on it yet. <laughs> so, update. We took them to the vet. They don't have a chip. So, that's good. And then we posted on a Facebook group their pictures to see if their owners would see the picture. And... Turns out someone in our neighborhood saw the picture and said that she had seen the dogs in her driveway and had been feeding them and giving them water for two days and they wouldn't like come to her. Like they were scared of her, but they literally followed Heather's car home. They're all starting to get along with Max really well too. So that's good. Cause he, he's a little butthole sometimes. We put Wayne in there to eat so that he doesn't get attacked. <laughs> it kind of looks like we put him in jail, but I promise he's just eating. Hi Winnie, you're the small little guy in the in the club, but you think you're the biggest. <laughs> you think you're just the biggest guy. Okay, I get you out. Thank you. <laughs> you got to be kidding me right now. You are so sweet, honey. <laughs> So, I'm laying in bed right now. Moppy is with me right now. Um, the two dogs are sleeping with Heather because we didn't want to separate them or anything. We're just trying to keep Max and them separate at nighttime because, okay, because of that. He's really upset that he's not with the dogs. Um, so he keeps going to my sister's door and barking incessantly. 
and I just got him to lay down, and he jumped off. So we're just hoping he gets tired soon. Um, but anyway, so tonight we had spaghetti, and we watched the new. Oh, well, it's not new anymore, but <laughs> feels new because we haven't watched it. The um, the morning show with. Steve Carell, Jennifer Aniston, Reese Witherspoon, and a bunch of other really big names. Like, I was like, wow. The reduction budget for this must have been crazy. Um, but we've been meaning to watch it for a long time, but we couldn't get Apple TV on the Roku. So we were like, eh, whatever. Um, but we it's finally an app on the Roku now, and we watched it. And oh my gosh, it's so good. I, like regardless of the storyline which is really good um the acting i feel like i could watch those people do an hour-long episode about poop and i'd still be like oh my god i feel like i would be just as entertained like the writing is so good too oh, don't get me wrong but um yeah so if you have apple tv and you haven't watched it yet what are you doing the freaking acting is so good oh my gosh the whole time i'm just watching like wow I feel like crap about myself right now. I need to go get some more acting classes because, geez, so freaking good. I mean, what was I expecting? Like, for real. And Friends in the Office are my two favorite shows, so I just love watching Jennifer Aniston and Steve Carell and like anything. And then Reese Witherspoon. Home Alabama is my favorite rom com of all time. And if you disagree with me, you're lying to yourself. Really, that cast is probably like a dream cast for me. Working with them would literally like. Well, first of all, I'd poop my pants. Um, probably quit for, because of nerves. <laughs> that would be like the best thing ever in my life. So if you're ever wondering what I want to do with my life, act with Steve Carell or Jennifer Aniston or Reese Witherspoon. Like they're just actors I really look up to. So I love watching them and stuff because it's just like an Olympic event of acting. Just watching it, you're like. I'm gonna try to only watch one episode a night just so it lasts longer, but it's really, really addicting, so. Anyway, I'm gonna go to bed. And I don't hear Max barking, so hopefully he's tired and he's just gonna come to bed. And we're gonna have a peaceful sleep. Hopefully. <laughs> for so we're getting supplies for the dogs at Walmart. What we're doing. Does anyone remember when they used to have fish right here? It was the coolest thing ever. It always comes straight over to the section. <laughs> we need bowls, crates, bedding for the Not crates. really a great variety of bowls here. Yeah. Like, I like this one. We're at PetSmart now because Walmart had nothing. They had one crate and no bowls, as you saw, so. We're here at Pets Right Looking now. Okay, so um, I'm in bed. It's like, um, what time is it? <laughs> it's probably around like, it's probably around like one right now. I just finished editing a video. I do my best editing in the middle of the night. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to pop on and end the vlog so you're not just ending with us in a pet smart um i think that's the last clip we got but yeah i hope you enjoyed the vlog and i hope to see you in next week's vlog if i do anything eventful enough to constitute a whole video but <laughs> yeah well i'll see you in my next video regardless so i love you guys thank you so much for watching